Hello everyone, my name is Susana Esper. I'm a professor of CSR and Business Statistics at the Essex School of Management. Imagine that you're a sustainability manager and that you're working for a company that claims to have a real interest in the environment and in the protection of natural resources. But you realize that the company does not practice what it preaches. How would you feel? And especially, how would you react to this situation? We usually use the term greenwashing to talk about the inconsistency between a company's sustainability talk and its concrete real actions. With the support of the FMR project and the Agence Nationale de la Recherche, and together with my colleagues Frank De Bakker and Nico Hewing, also from Yesex School of Management, we are currently exploring the internal impact of greenwashing. I will walk you through our research in the next 60 seconds. Scholars have explored the subject of greenwashing before, but often from the perspective of external observers, such as customers or governments. Conversely, our research looks at how the perception of greenwashing triggers reactions among sustainability managers. These are the people who are in charge of transforming a company's sustainability strategy into day-to-day -day concrete operations. That makes them essential in overcoming the gap between sustainability talk and practices. We explore how managers react to different kinds of contradictory talk and actions, either coming from top management, from colleagues in other functional levels, such as other middle managers, or from customers who do not act consistently with their claims on sustainability. We found that these experiences trigger strong negative emotions and lead to higher turnover intention for sustainability managers. What this means is that they would be more likely to look for other shops if they have experienced such circumstances a long time. In times where sustainability has become a key topic for most companies, this research helps us to understand certain aspects that could make the position of sustainability managers challenging and also gives practical insights on how we can strengthen their roles. Thank you very much for your attention and please contact us if you want to know more.